Now I hope you've been using your pepper mill and your salt mill quite a bit. And well, if you have, it's possible that it's not working quite as perfectly as when you first bought it. It might need a little bit of a cleaning. I think mine does. So. I like to push this mechanism in, it's spring-loaded, and you can open up the nut pretty easily then. Now remember, remember, this is salt and this is pepper, so when you go to refill, you want to make sure you're only putting salt in the salt. Because the salt mill has the plastic mechanism. See right there? You let all of the pepper and salt out of the, out of the mill, like Don't that. Don't the little nut. So we just pop it out, like that. Or you can just push against a magazine, against your stomach, if you've got a strong enough stomach. The thing that's cool about this, that this is, Fletcher's Mill is the only pepper mill where you can actually take this whole mechanism out and clean it, which is really fantastic. Not only does it have a lifetime guarantee, but it's actually just going to stay and it's going to be your favorite pepper mill for the next 25 years. Now, if you don't have a brush, you can just take a napkin and really the most important part is right in here. See on the salt shaker on the plastic mechanism? I'm just putting that rag in there and wiping that. And then just want to make sure that's really good and clean of any of the oil. And keeping this grinding mechanism in the stainless steel shaft really nice and clean. Now when you go back in, there's a little ring in there. You want to make sure you put the end of this back through that little ring, okay? So you don't want to do it if you've had a couple of drinks. <laughs> and then using two thumbs, push that back in just like, like that. that. And then you can see how it's, the spring is loaded and it's working perfectly. And just hold it then with your thumb. Put the top back on or refill it again. Well, and then you see when when you push that in, the little screw on top comes up and it makes it a lot easier to take this nut and put it back on the top. Who's calling you me a nut? Well, you are a nut, for sure. All right, all okay. right, that. In your back end business, and it's working better than ever. So, now that your pepper mill's in tip top shape, I hope you're enjoying it and having, cooking lots of delicious meals. Let's go over there for dinner, you want it? Mm -hmm. Okay.